subscribe and download over 1 million code snippet including this tutorial from codegive.com, link in the description below. Certainly. Here's a step-by-step -step tutorial on how to install Python 3.7 on Windows 10, along with code examples. Open your web browser and go to the official Python website, Python Downloads. On the Downloads page, locate the section for Python 3.7, or the version you desire, and click on the link to download the installer for Windows. Once the installer is downloaded, locate the file, usually in the Downloads folder, and double-click on it to run the installer. In the Python installer, make sure to check the box that says Add Python 3.x to Path before proceeding. This will make Python easily accessible from the command prompt. Click the Install Now button to start the installation process. After the installation is complete, open the command prompt by pressing Win plus R, typing CMD, and pressing Enter. Type the following command to check if Python was installed successfully. This should display the installed Python version, such as Python 3.7.x. Open a text editor, like Notepad or Visual Studio Code, and create a simple Python script. For example, create a file named hello.py with the following content. Save the file. Open the command prompt and navigate to the directory where you saved your hello.py file using the cd command. Run the script using the following command. You should see the output. Congratulations! You have successfully installed Python 3.7 on Windows 10 and executed a simple Python script. Now you're ready to explore and develop using Python on your Windows machine. ChatGPT Certainly! Installing Python 3.7 on Windows 10 is a straightforward process. Follow the steps below to install Python on your Windows machine, and I'll include code examples where necessary. Open the command prompt by pressing Win plus R, typing CMD, and hitting Enter. Type the following command to check if Python is installed successfully. You should see something like Python 3.7.x in response. Setting up a virtual environment is good practice to isolate your Python projects. To create a virtual environment. Open command prompt and navigate to the directory where you want to create the virtual environment. Run the following commands. You can now use pip to install Python packages within your virtual environment. For example, let's install the requests library. Create a new Python script using a text editor like Notepad or Visual Studio Code. For example, Create a file named hello.py and add the following code. Save the script. In the command prompt, navigate to the directory containing your script. Run the script using the following command. You should see the output hello, python 3.7 on Windows 10, printed on the screen. Congratulations! You've successfully installed python 3.7 on Windows 10, set up a virtual environment, installed a package using pip, and executed a simple Python script. ChatGPT Python is a powerful and widely used programming language, and installing it on your Windows 10 machine is a straightforward process. In this tutorial, we will guide you through the steps to install Python 3.7 on Windows 10. Open your web browser and go to the official Python website, Python Downloads. On the homepage, you will see a prominent button that says Downloads. Click on it. Scroll down to find the section titled Looking for a specific release, and click on View the full list of Python releases. Locate Python 3.7 in the list and click on it. You will be directed to the release page. Scroll down to the Files section and choose the Windows installer that matches your system architecture, either 32-bit or 64-bit. For most modern systems, 64-bit is recommended. 
Click on the installer link to start the download. Once the installer is downloaded, locate the file, typically in your downloads folder, and double click on it to run the installer. In the Python 3.7 setup window, check the box that says add Python 3.7 to path. This option is essential for easily running Python commands from the command prompt. Click install now to begin the installation. The installer will copy the necessary files and set up Python on your system. After the installation is complete, you will see a screen that says setup was successful. Ensure that the checkbox saying disable path length limit is selected. Click on the close button to exit the installer. Open the command prompt by pressing Win plus R, typing CMD, and hitting enter. To verify that Python has been installed correctly, type the following command and press enter. You should see something like Python 3.7.x in response. Additionally, you can check if the pip package manager is installed by running. You should see information about the installed version of pip. Congratulations! You have successfully installed Python 3.7 on your Windows 10 machine. You can now start writing and running Python code on your system. Remember to check the official Python documentation for any updates or additional information. Python documentation. Chat GPT. Python is a versatile and powerful programming language that is widely used for various applications, including web development, data analysis, artificial intelligence, and more. Installing Python on Windows 10 is a straightforward process, and this tutorial will guide you through the steps. Visit the official Python website, Python Downloads. On the homepage, click on the Downloads tab. Scroll down and find the section titled Looking for a specific release. In the View the full list of downloads section, Locate Python 3.7 and select the installer appropriate for your system. For Windows, you may choose the Windows x86-64 executable installer if you have a 64-bit system or the Windows x86 executable installer for 32-bit systems. Click on the selected installer to start the download. Locate the downloaded installer file, usually in your downloads folder. Double-click on the installer file to launch the Python installer. On the first screen, make sure to check the box that says Add Python 3.x to path. This option is essential for easily running Python commands from the command prompt. Click on the Install Now button to start the installation. Once the installation is complete, open the command prompt or PowerShell. Type the following command and press enter to check if Python has been installed successfully. You should see output similar to Python 3.7.x, indicating that Python 3.7 is installed. PIP is a package installer for Python. To check if it's installed, type the following command and press enter. If PIP is installed, you'll see its version information. Create a simple Python script using a text editor, example Notepad, or VS Code. For example, create a file named hello.py with the following content. Save the file. Open the command prompt or PowerShell, navigate to the directory where you saved hello.py, and run the script. You should see the output hello, Python 3.7 on Windows 10. Congratulations! You have successfully installed Python 3.7 on Windows 10 and executed a simple Python script. Now you are ready to explore the world of Python development on your Windows machine. ChatGPT